wheels around, goes, it sort of dribbles under everybody there. Hugh Beasley tackled, and that's holding the ball. Beautifully done by Dan Johnston, made his debut last week. Meek got rid of Bella using that big frame and then gave a don't argue, but did too much. Yeah, the Hawks defending very well. Clark, that's a high up and under. It won't get there. It'll spill to ground. Kicking out of the pack is a nice one there. Flynn Gentile, he is having some sort of a start to this game. Calling for it is Weddle. He doesn't go there. He goes a little bit longer. Goes over the head of everybody, including O'Sullivan. And now Simpson can get it out to Walker. And Coburg can clear it up. Carigliano, Waitman, here on the near side wing. That is a beautiful kick to McKenzie. He wanted to go, didn't. Now he'll go for the kick. Inside the 50, and Jai Baddeley Kelly with some elite body work. He wheels around, great looking kick. for the teammate. It was sensational. That was a great kick. And that's Aaron Clark. It should be, but how about the ball use here in the Coburg defensive area? They didn't panic, they were composed, and they used the ball well. Aaron Clark puts that one straight through the middle, and Coburg have their advantage yet again. 2-2-14 two, two, plays 1-2-8. Now they can get it in through Boucher. Gee whiz. Over to They've Simpson. Done it again. Yep. Gee, their run and carry has been really impressive. But Certainly. More impressive has just been their composure. They haven't panicked. To extend the advantage. Tell you what, that is a sensational kick. Jai Baddeley Kelly, he's on the board. Coburg have their third. They're saying to get it down there to Johnston. They're outnumbered in defence there, Box Hill. Gentile, is it 50? No. Gentile goes long inside the 50, looking for Baddeley Kelly, and he takes the mark. Pick 18 in last year's draft. As Coburg put the pressure on. Masidi is taken out and claps on the bench. Another short so measure kick. kick. What do they do here? What do they do here? 60 out. Gentile inside the 50. Johnston! Oh. Nice strong clunk from the big man from directly in front. Dan Johnston makes no mistake. And they stem the run of eight consecutive goals from Box Hill. Now they can move it. McKenzie. Low data goes over everybody's head. Blank got it out. Oh. Bursting through is Johnston. He didn't have it. He wanted the free. McGlashan has been a free paid advantage here. And they do get reward for effort. Sam Mason took the advantage and benefited from some high pressure play from the Coburg Lions. They get their second of the quarter. The pack flew. O'Sullivan went without it. And then it ended up with him. He tr still tries to get out. Almost did. Umpire says it's mine. And he's still down, Jacob Kaczynski, as the play continues. Bramble, he's tackled. That's holding the ball. It's going to be... A big chance here for the Coburg Lions. Getting it out there was Nolan, and inside the 50 goes Jepsen, and Clark takes the mark, runs into the open goal, and slots it. Goes to the ground. Mercedes in there, wrapped up. So Coburg get their first sort of entry forward. Finds Bennett's. Who slung around? He did get a handball, but the umpire said yeah, holding that's the fair ball. Enough. Yep. He had his opportunity. He was slung around. Yep. If you generally, if you've slung 360, that's gone. Dropping oh. there, and it will be a high tackle. Oh no! It's holding the ball. It is holding the ball. Callum Porter. It might have been Josh Morris, was it? Oh no, it was Josh Morris. Sorry. Yep. <laughs>